Our next guest is a fashion stylist, and she's also the woman behind the popular blog, StyleClosetLife.com. And now she's teaming up with PeoplesChoice.com for the new web series, Hashtag Fashion FOMO. <laughs> Angela Denae, welcome to Arise 360. Thank you so much for having me. All right, Hashtag Fashion FOMO. Yes. For people who don't know, what does FOMO mean? FOMO means Not fear. like FOMO years. Not FOMO years. Okay. It's, <laughs> it's a fashion fear of missing out. So okay. basically, you know, you see a trend on a style, on a celebrity and you're like, I really want to try this, but I don't know how. Oh. So our series is showing you different ways to try uh, style, you know, yeah, in your own way. Mm -hmm. Okay, so will you be taking the celebrity looks and then recreating it? Is that how it goes? What's the premise of the show? Yeah, so the premise is basically we have a celebrity crush and we create outfits based on that celebrity crush. Okay. Still keeping true to our own style, but using theirs too. All right. Yeah. So who's your celebrity crush? My celebrity crush is uh, today Solange Knowles. Solange oh, Knowles. Yes. You've got her hair. Yes. <laughs> Do you have that white Stephanie Rowland jumpsuit, though? I am working on that. OK. <laughs> you know, I saw it last night, and I am working on that right now. Did that not just break the internet? It was amazing. Oh, next I level fashion. It. Yes. Next wow. level fashion. All right. And you've also brought in a celebrity look that you've kind of styled for us today as well, right? Yes, I okay. did. OK. So tell us about the outfit as you have our model come out and show us the look. OK. <laughs> well, no, just talk to us. She's coming. Tell okay. us about the look. Yeah. Well, she has on a Ooh. Harbison. Ooh. There she is. All Red right. wool. Yes. Fur collar. Woo! Milton overcoat. Oh. Fabulous all over the place. I don't think the model's going to leave with this if Lola has anything to do with it. That one's mine. She loves Harbison. <laughs> she, underneath, she has on a, a Zara button-down shirt. Oh, OK. And then Zara jeans. Nice. Mm -hmm. And finishes up with a Zara black shoe. So ah. it's all of this is affordable. Well, the yes, coat is actually Yes, except for the, the you know the coat is a definitely an investment piece. Mm -hmm. But I love showing ways of how you can work the high and low yes. in your wardrobe because that's how every, everybody really dresses. And what style crush is this based off of? This one's based off of uh, Solange. Solange also. Oh, yes. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Nice. Very minimalistic, but uh -huh. it has that that oomph and it has the color. Yes, mm. and it's a pop of color that makes it takes it to the next level. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. In Zara, obviously very accessible. How do we track down Mr. Harbison? We've had him on the show. Yes. I actually interviewed him. He's a fantastic designer. Yes. But for people who don't have access to him, how do we find his creations? You find it on Harbison.com. Harbison.com. Yes. Okay. So Not one of the other things that you teach your clients. <clears throat> how to shop their closet. What yes. exactly does that mean and how can we mm -hmm. shop our closets? So basically you go into your closet with a new eye. Mm -hmm. So you go in seeing the pieces that you can layer. For example, like this Harbison coat that we just saw. Mm -hmm. You can wear that over a, le a leather jacket. Okay. You can wear that over the button down. You can wear that over a dress. So just finding different new ways to wear the clothes that are already in your closet. You can actually oh. wear it as a dress if you belt it Oh, it up. See? Yeah. Oh, so yes. you're just repurposing the things you already have. You don't need to spend any new money. No new money. <laughs> Repurpose. <laughs> Until you need to get that harvest and coat. Oh, of course. <laughs> Once you have that, you're good to go, right? Yes. Thank you. <laughs> exactly. Oh, so what do you think the ultimate thing you want viewers to take away from your show is? Basically to, you know, try new things. When you get inspired by a celebrity that you see online, don't, you know, don't try to find exactly what they wear head to toe. Mm -hmm. See how you can work it into your own wardrobe, your own way, keeping true to your own style. So be inspired by them, but don't ha you don't have to copy them directly. Absolutely, yes. So are there things you should focus on when you are trying to create a look, like the cut, the color? What's the most important thing to I usually that? focus in on, you know, what stands out the most for me for that, that uh, particular celebrity. Like okay. a staple piece? Yes. So okay. with Solange, I always think of, she always has those minimal but like very strong pieces. Right. She's not over accessorized. Mm -hmm. um, so with her, you know, I, I don't do like an earring or a bracelet or necklaces. Okay. Whereas another celebrity may be, may be the total opposite. So you just play into what that celebrity does. What other celebs out there are crush worthy? Who should we be watching for inspiration? Um, I think Leah Michelle is actually very great. Really? Mm -hmm. okay. Yes. Completely. And yeah, she. Um, she does very well with wearing clothing that fits her body type. Okay. So, so she's, she's a very a, petite girl. Very petite, but she looks so much taller. Yeah. And on you know on video and on and on camera, and it's just because she knows how to really wear the things that fit her. Yeah, and mm -hmm. to elongate her body. Absolutely, okay. and she doesn't stray from that either. All right. All right. So what about the guys? You have any guy style crushes? <laughs> uh, hmm. Guys style crushes. I like Common. 
Oh, okay. Yes. What do you like about his look? <laughs> his look good. is very, I always feel like he's very regal and very just, he knows, he knows his, his mm -hmm. look. Okay. And he stays true to it all the time. And he also always looks comfortable, like he's not like, ah, yes. doesn't like yeah. work with the suit or whatever exactly. he's wearing. Exactly. Okay. Now the series, uh, it's a 10 part series. Mm -hmm. Is that how it works? It's being produced by Mark Burnett. Yes. When can we watch it? How can we watch it? Walk us through that. Okay, so my video is going to be premiering tomorrow at 10 a.m. Congratulations. Exciting. Mm -hmm. uh, it's coming out every Tuesday at 10 a.m. So okay. it's a new stylist, a new blogger, a new fashion, you know, it person. Okay. Who's showing your, their ways on how to create style. Okay. Now, how is your blog that you do different from the show? Uh, my blog is basically showing ways that I take items from that I find in the, th the thrift store or on sale or in my closet. Uh, t I have one where I turned a trench coat into a vest. Oh. Uh, so just showing just lots of different ways to maximize your wardrobe. Now, what made you decide to start a blog in the first place? <laughs> Moving to New York and realizing it's very expensive, mm -hmm. and I need to find the way to still look in style, but you know, not spend so much money really? doing it. Yes. And okay. how has life as a blogger been for you? I mean, there's a perception that bloggers just sit at home in their pajamas <laughs> yeah. type, right? and type away. Oh, I but, wish. Yeah, <laughs> but that couldn't be further from the truth for a lot of bloggers. Yes, a lot of bloggers, is, we're kind of like stylists as well. So we're, mm. we're meeting new designers, we're meeting different types of um, people and other bloggers where we can collaborate with and it's a lot of running back and forth. It's a lot of fun, but it is definitely a lot of work that goes behind those posts. Yeah. All right, so we can catch a new show starting on every Tuesday and we can also check out your stylecloselife.com. Yes. All right. All right. Thank you so much. Right. Thank you. Shanice, <laughs> better come back with my coat. Right. <laughs> great model, great model. <laughs> and you better come back. You're watching Rise Entertainment 360. <laughs> great job. That's fun.